What's good, everybody? It's your boy, O'Shea Duke Jackson. Back at it again with another episode of The Celebrity Jump. Dima, let's get some story time music. So the other day, which was yesterday, I was sitting back reading the Bible. Church music! And God was really dealing with me. He was speaking into my soul. Amen. And then I got an Instagram message. Notification. Give me a notification sound, Dima. Boom. And it was our good brother who was checking in with your boy, brother Tobias Q. Brown. Give him a round of applause. That's his Instagram. Go follow our brother over there. He's really in these, you know, in these streets trying to expose these niggas out here and everything like that. Right. And so brother Tobias sends me this clip that, you know, I think I've seen his brother on Facebook before, but that the real earthquake reposted on his Instagram. But before he, and, and this is brother out there. That's pretty much, I don't know if he's joking around, but he has this picture as you see here. And he's saying 23 years old, no kids, homeowner, car owner, business owner, BA in computer science, looking for women who are single, real hair, no kids, make a minimum of 120K annually, must be in shape, must own a home, a luxury vehicle, cannot weigh over 50 pounds. And you see the brother is looking, uh, you know, like he's looking. Oh my God. More power to you, right? But we gonna go over how the brother got roasted up in the comments by sisters. But before that, Brother Brown had told me and warned me what I was going to see. Let's go ahead and play that clip. O'Shea, what's good, brother? Listen, so Earthquake posted this to this brother. I don't know if this is true or not. However, um, he had a lot of unrealistic uh, expectations and everything he wanted, blah, 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 blah. And when they got to the comment section, if you check the comment section, the women went hamburger on them. They have no apologies. Nobody said nothing. Now, as soon as your boy, <laughs> the godfather, get on here and say anything about one woman, they'd be like, girl, live your best life. You're a queen. Don't let nobody talk to you. How come the standards for men, women being okay to say what they want to say is okay, but you can't have the same standards for men? They bogus for that. They bogus for that. Even though this brother do kind of look dusty, but that's neither here nor that. Yeah. But he shoot this shot like any of these women who... You know, five foot one, 220, talking about it all fall in the right place. Ooh, honey, fall yourself on that treadmill. Anyway, peace. We want to thank brother Tobias for that information. Give him a round of applause. <laughs> now we're going to head over to the post. And shout out to the real earthquake who posted this over there in these streets. Now, he put any takers, right? It was 627,000 to 627 comments. And I like Earthquake. He's a damn good comedian. Now, look at the first comment. Date music. Looks like Norman is finally tired of rescue you show. The other girl says, the one time I'm super happy about not fitting the qualifications hard pass. Lucy says, date music. I'd rather play for the other team. Damn. This other chick says, the audacity. I mean, really, the I'm going to get it gone. Your dream come true says, um, he could at least catfish us, damn. And Miss Brainy says, thankfully I don't fit the profile. Tracy says, why the pics look dirty? Miss Fraser says, the nerve. And the roasting goes on and on and on and on. Okay? But see, like Brother QB Brown, see, you see that? Now the guy was probably joking. He knows that he looks a little struggle, probably. He ain't trying to deny that. But you see, once he put out his preferences, what happened? Okay? Okay? They mad. They are mad. That's the issue here. Now they're upset. Why are they upset? Because black men can't have those standards. Now all of those chicks that were roasting him, all of them, and some of them didn't look good. Some of them were, you know, looking like water buffaloes. We're gonna keep it real. We didn't show their face, but they will go over there. You will see a lot of room over there, okay? They are really Buffalo arenas, okay? That's all I want to say. Some of them are really big. I bet you they can say they want six figures. What about Kevin Samuel's show? Remember that classic show where you had that chick who didn't look that hot? She wanted those figures too. And guess what? He is exactly the same thing that she is. He ain't even have no kids. 
he's 23. When he wants the same thing that she want, now they mad. And I think the brother actually trolled everybody, did it on purpose, but do you see what it is? It's okay for them to want everything and have nothing, but the black man can't have nothing and want everything. You see, it's okay for them to do it. See the, hypocr see the hypocrisy in that? See how sandaled up that is? See how dusty that is? That is dusty. It is completely dusty, musty, crusty, and dusty. All the usties. <laughs> Shout out to Obsidian. And I'm going I'm to just be honest. Uh, can I say this? For some black men, this is one of the reasons why they don't deal, deal in the black America no more. Well, I'll just be honest. Okay? And it's not that black men don't deal in black America because they don't like black women. Black men don't deal in black America because of the hypocrisy. Niggas are tired of the hypocrisy. That's what it's about. It's too much hypocrisy going on in these streets. So when you out here hella hypocritical, niggas be mad. That's what it's about. It be too many lies. They was roasting him all the way up. But see, if that was a if that was the uh, white man, or, or let me not say the white man, but if that was a black man saying that, listen, y'all be calling for him to get his job taken. He need to be fired. Oh, and my favorite, he's the G word, he's LGBT. Now, wait a minute. All those sisters that were boasting their brother, are they, are they LGBT now? Do they not like men? Hmm? Do they not like men? I want to know. Stop playing with me. And it's, it's actually sad. And y'all have been exposed again with your dusty ass. I'll hear, I'll hear just, I'll hear sound it up. Want everything. That's why I don't deal with. That's why. That's why I'm tired of. You know what's up? Show? I'm tired of you. I'm tired. I'm tired of y'all. I'm so tired of y'all. Both the men and women. I'm tired of y'all. That's why I don't deal with y'all no more. I'm tired of you. Y'all be just lying all the time. Just oh my goodness. Let me just stop. Let me let far go far 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 go off on y'all. And it's a shame. It's, it's, it's pathetic. So guys, it's your boy. O'Shea Duke Jackson. Back at it again with another episode of The Celebrity Junk. I really appreciate you for all that you do. Subscribe to the bell. Check out the first comment pinned to the top, brothers. Check out the Black Men Are Perp t-shirts. And as you know, the buffoonery remains at an all-time high. I'm out. <laughs>